Hello, this is Kat for Blue Skies and Tamales and today we are in Oaxaca City. Today is 1st of November, it's almost 12.30 p.m. It's very hot right now, 24 degrees Celsius, 78 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, I think. Uh, today we're going to walk around this uh, area just to see what's going on. There's a lot of people out, very excited for Day of the Dead and just to enjoy, you know, very excited to enjoy the Oaxacan architecture and open spaces and culture. This is the entrance of the Botanical Garden. You have to book your tickets online and then you can come and and enter. I haven't seen seen it inside just in the pictures and it looks really lovely to be honest. I hope I can show you uh, what it looks like during my time here. There's so many people here. Uh, a local told me that not as many as previous years because of COVID but it's still very lively. I think it's just <laughs> so, so nice to be here at this time of the year. Something that I really like about this area specifically is that there are some terraces. So you can enjoy some food and drinks while having a beautiful view. I would say that this tree is my favorite spot in Oaxaca City. Uh, I really love the, love the shade, I love uh, laying down there and just spending some time chilling and um, this is a Casa Oaxaca a famous and very tasty restaurant uh, I really really like the food here um, I want to show you also there are some day of the dead decorations here yeah um, some dogs and the family and people just come here and, and, and take pictures It's very sunny right now. I, I'm enjoying getting some sun and, and walking on these stone paved streets. I know every time I think about Oaxaca, I imagine a landscape uh, full of earthy color buildings, earthy color uh, details. I know it just give, gives me that feeling because here is hot, but not like humid hot, it's like dry hot. And, and during the rainy season, yeah, the hills look green, but the rest of the year, it looks pretty dry. And I don't know, it's just like the sensation of being in this valley. I also love the, love so much, the, like the brick colors on these steps. Great place to walk, play and just enjoy the afternoon. I want to show you here, there is some Day of the Dead decorations. One of the views of the beautiful street of Oaxaca. Many people come to Oaxaca and fell immediately in love with it. I understand why it's such a lovely place, place to be in. Prices are very affordable, culture is so rich, uh, so full of color, so full of tradition, food is incredible. You should definitely come to, to Oaxaca if you visit Mexico. of human health 
skeleton. This here is the church of Santo Domingo, the main church in Oaxaca city. Very beautiful, so many weddings happening here all, all the time. And, and now people just come here, take pictures in front of it, and, you know, and show that they're living the best time in Oaxaca city. We're gonna walk along the Andador Turistico. Again, you can find another tour of this street in the channel. Um, <laughs> um, but now it's, you know, middle of the day, so many people gathering and it's so sunny. I, I hope the colors look better this time. A Katrina, yep. So beautiful with the with the bright green color. So I'm filming too. Oh, two dogs just go crazy. It just feels so nice to stroll along this touristic uh, uh, yeah, like street. You can see there are so many foreigners, so many tourists. There's a beautiful plaza here. People are chilling and protecting from the sun, just resting to keep walking in this beautiful city. Another Katrina here with a beautiful blue dress. And these arches, wow, that, that looks really, really beautiful. I forgot to bring my hat, so I think I'm gonna get some sun today. Oh, this, this is really nice. Uh, I like all the, the skeleton decorations. Last night I was walking, I was crossing this uh, 
this street and it was so full of people. I wanted to film, but it was almost impossible to film. But I had a bit So, uh, yeah, uh, there wasn't uh, much to show. Uh, there was just tons of people. And this, this decoration is, the, is like a traditional way of decorating the entrances of the houses of places, you know, with wooden figures, clay figures, some plants, leaves. And because we are in Mexico, there's always place to get things done. Like here, people can get their makeup done, their Katrina, or like a, like a human school. Um, I, I just love that. It's like you can just come here. It's like, oh, I want to dress like a, like a Katrina. And then just come here and someone can uh, put makeup on your face. I want to show you these two skeletons. <laughs> just, it's, yeah, skeletons full of life. They're just dancing and enjoying life, I guess. I don't know. Uh, This is the entrance of another house. It looks so beautiful. Um, there is an altar inside, let me show you. Not so traditional, but not. With some fruits and bread and some decorations to receive the deceased souls that are visiting us during these two days. Many people wearing flowers in, like on their heads, some traditional blouses. I mean, now I can see there's some people, but I can't imagine how it was before, like before COVID. <laughs> Maybe this was crowded, like fully crowded all the time. Oh, how things have changed. Oh, and this beautiful courtyard.
now we are at the Zócalo. This would be the end of this walk. I hope you like this little short video of Oaxaca Center. Let me know in the comment sections what you think about this place, about this video, and I hope you like it. Mm. Well, I hope you like this video, subscribe, thumbs up, and see you in the next video. Bye!